Yeah, I thought that was gonna be really aesthetic and graceful. <laughs> My mistake, forgot who I was. And it's about as good as that intro is gonna get. What is up guys? It is a beautiful Saturday morning here in Texas. And when I say beautiful, um, well, it's still beautiful, but it is 28 degrees here this morning. Um, the old 6-7 had a really nice cold start sound, though. I will tell you that uh, because I haven't heard that in a minute. So, drinking my, one of my new favorite energy drinks. And no, I'm not sponsored, but if you guys can make that happen, that would be cool. Just kidding. Um, 3D energy drinks. This one literally tastes like a bomb pop. I'm recording with my phone, and I'm pretty sure there's peanut butter on my lens. But that's fine. Okay, so first I'm going to finish up powder coating some diff covers uh, for my friend 73 Queen. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna show you guys that a little bit. First, I need to move out uh, these bars. I've already taken that one down, but it was way too heavy for me to pick up the whole thing and no one else is here yet. So I'm gonna take those down and get started. <laughs> so JC came here, just, you know, help me prep it the right way. <laughs> That's how it's done. It smells terrible. And your babies are here now! Have you ever seen a Hummer this clean, Kobe? Hey, remember what it looks like now? Because two weeks ago, cool. <laughs> I would never. Why do your stupid friends? <laughs> Yeah. Yours smells like an old grandma's vagina. <laughs> Are you giving it two weeks? I thought you'd give it two weeks. Three days. There's it only took me a couple to ruin JC's truck. There's literally trouble. mold in your center console. <laughs> That's disgusting. You better not call me because I'm not detailing it. Nope. Nope. So, guys, something really strange just happened. Um... I was driving from my house back to the shop and missed an accident by probably a couple seconds. I didn't see it, but I saw this little puppy take off running across the road and everyone was already stopped for the accident. Um, and I was afraid she was going to get hit. So I jumped out and grabbed the dog. Um, and I was directly behind the car that had the worst part of the accident. Um, and like I said, I didn't see it, but I just came up on it. So I, the dog came right to me and I was like, okay, like get in the truck. And then I ran up to him and I'm like, are you okay? And he's like, yeah, but that's my dog. Um, and I'm like, well, you know, your car's destroyed. So I'll keep him in mind, like until you get someone here. Um, and he thinks he might be going to jail. So I have a dog for a little bit. Um, and he has my cell phone number so hopefully someone gets a hold of me but he said this dog is like his life and like I totally understand that's why I wasn't gonna let it run out into traffic so I'm headed back to the shop now um, I called the boys when I was in the middle of all that and they're like that is not a good place for you to be like you need to leave before the cops come there so I tried to but the cop you know didn't want to talk I guess we'll see how this goes. So apparently this is how this little girl caused the wreck because she jumped over in his lap. I'm just in the shop parking lot right now so it doesn't matter, but she's not very good at that. I'm gonna record the boys' reaction. I have a new friend. He's probably terrified right now. What are you doing? Do you like roll or what? Uh, just, this car's pretty trash. What, what are you I'm do? recording just for your reaction. <laughs> uh, so she jumped over in his lap like this and hit the steering wheel and he head on somebody. I thought the guy, is it bleeding? So you are like, yeah, let's just ride with this dog that just caused an accident in my lap. Well, I was going like, like five oh, miles oh, an hour. Sit your ass back down, you're gonna scratch yourself. <laughs> so on a maybe less eventful note, here's the new build, guys. Here it is. And of course, we're getting rid of all the chrome and of course it's gonna be a crap ton bigger. So we had to bring this little girl back to the house. And I had JC drive me um, because, well, for a lot of reasons, but because I didn't want her to jump in, you know, the person driving's lap. And then magically, I had to poop so bad on the way between here and there. And he always says funny stuff 
And honestly, I pooped my pants a couple times. I'm not gonna sit here and lie. So I was really scared. And I'm like, this is gonna be a really eventful night. And probably gonna poop my pants, but I made it. She's here eating now. Rudis is outside. I know that's the, I was like man this is not my truck and their cloth seats that's the only reason I didn't let her go I'm not gonna lie so we brought Rudis to take back to the shop since we didn't want him and the other dog at the house with each other and we get the Dollar General for some snacks and the guy calls and sees if we can bring it to his parents' house so that's where we're going now we're going going right back to the house to get it Rudis you have to go back home sorry buddy Tatey boy. Let me see your paw. Taylor, let me see your paw. Let me see your paw. Let me see your paw. Oh. Oh, we're going to see both. Oh, God. <laughs> okay. Okay, see you guys later. Oh, my God. Okay. My leggings are trash. <laughs> All right, guys. So we came to see one of our friends. I'm just gonna close this door. I'm gonna let you guys experience the excitement that I just experienced. Are you ready? Seems like a little hard door to open. Hi, Megan. Hello. <laughs> oh, okay, that door's just stuck. Look how messy that one. Look at jeans. Oh, sorry. We drove that. Obsessed. I would just set up a bed right here. Just stare at him. Wake up to him every morning. So cool. Zach said, let's check out the inside. This bad boy. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so cool. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Hi, here. Oh, Hi, good. I love that they're just casually like, oh, yeah, you want to see the shop? No one told me all of this was in here. They look so much cooler in here than they do outside. So what here I am vlogging. What, what do you keep your garage? You don't keep Peter Bill from your garage? No, they're just like, yeah, you want to see? Yeah, sure. Yeah, you can see the shop. Like, what? <laughs> you got your bed and you have your Peter Bill. Oh, that's all you need. You and you have your <laughs> so it snowed all day today. And we're actually stuck. First of all, Texas, you're drunk. I guess I brought the Utah weather with me. <laughs> Can you imagine everyone with little cars that has no idea that they would ever need four wheel drive? Yeah, but I Wait, what'd you say? Oh! <laughs> 